Hi everyone! Welcome to Super Bouch Kitchen. And our dish for today, you know what? This is the traditional Chinese old-time favorite, which is the lo mein noodles. So we're gonna give you a very nice daily cuisine today that you can put it in your plate all the time for kids and your family to love, okay? For our lo mein noodles, ingredients guys we have beef 150 grams carrots 130 grams and we have one pack 500 grams lo mein we do have the asparagus 30 grams cabbage 135 grams green onions 55 grams garlic 5 grams white onions 80 grams soy sauce 2 tablespoon and 2 tablespoon fish sauce and we're gonna use the virgin cock virgin olive oil for our deep frying for using it for frying and we do have a tablespoon of Chinese Shaoseng rice cooking wine and we have one cup chicken stock to add with that which I'm boiling right now and one tablespoon sesame oil but starting our lo mein noodles I do have my chicken stock here look at that I make a homemade chicken stock so it's made of chicken wings and some chicken bone it's so delicious it's already prepared and this is our boiling soon to boil water for our lo mein we need to make sure that the lo mein will be only cooked for two minutes because she's fresh and she's already partly cooked. So we're going to put our virgin oil here. Kind of like a two tablespoon guys. Perfect. And I always do with the onions first. It's better to Start with the onions and after will be the garlic, okay? So we're gonna make this brown. We cannot overcook it. Just like a two minute cooking this. Because she doesn't look good if she's also dark brown. So it's just lightly cooked. She's fresh. The lumen is very easy cooking and this is the old we're gonna put our garlic here the garlic is very healthy fresh garlic to make it smelling good take note all super bauchi kitchen doesn't have any MSG when we cook here okay so you need to follow all the ingredients carefully so that it will be tasty okay and we're gonna do our carrots. Three. Okay, I just added the green onions there. Perfect. So that looks super good. You just do medium heat, okay? And we're gonna. I'm gonna show you how to teach the right way of making this lo mein noodles perfect, okay? First, we're gonna cut her. One third, three times because she's very long. She's all together wrapped. So I washed it right in my hands. I'm gonna dip it here. Watch. You need to make sure because the noodles is connected. So you have to cut it to make it more. It won't be too long. Okay, so I did just put the boiling water. The lo mein, guys, is different when, from the chow mein. She's already cooked. So you have to be careful not to overcook the lo mein. So that's why I just boiled the water. And what I did with the water, I just soaked the lo mein quick. And we're going to make sure that all these noodles will be separated. Okay? See that guys? So she's already separated. 
and she's got a little shorter okay perfect again she's the low main is already cooked so we gotta be careful just dip it in the boiling water for two minutes okay and we're gonna drain her here so we're gonna drain her and let her sit aside okay guys it's a 500 grams one package of lo mein it's a fresh cooked lo mein already from our asian market okay guys let it sit there it's gonna focus here so we have first our onions our garlic and our carrots Carrots are very um, hard to cook a little bit, so we gotta make sure she's ahead of everybody too. And we added a green onion, it smells so good. Now, at this point, we're gonna add our beef. Okay. So delicious, look at that. Not overcook the beef as well, we'll just spread it out, give it a toss. It's only medium heat all throughout this time because everything is cooked except the meat, right? Okay, if you wish to add shrimp, it's possible. If you wish some to add even quail eggs, it is beautiful. Okay. And click like and subscribe there so that you can see a lot of videos. Okay, so I'm gonna put here our soy sauce. See that? That is our soy sauce. And I also add our fish sauce okay I usually put a fusion of two kinds of sauce like the soy sauce because it's pretty good taste if you do it that way okay okay guys look at that keep toasting it and we're gonna add our Chelsea rice cooking wine okay Again, Super Bauchi Kitchen, we don't put any MSG, so we put all the spices to make it more tasty. Okay, and we will be putting some one tablespoon of sesame oil. It's up to you if you want to make it two tablespoons, it's so tasty. My tablespoon is a Chinese tablespoon, so it's just very big. Look at that. You can adjust whatever your needs are. Perfect, smells good, guys. And of course, we're going to add asparagus. The asparagus neutralizes the taste of everything. And of course, we're going to put our cabbage here. That makes it colorful. And our salt. And of course, Salt always goes to the pepper. I like the fresh pepper corn. Look at that, it's so big and cool. Perfect. Okay, we're almost done. This is a very quick traditional Chinese dish. And you can actually stir it like this way. Look at that. Smells good, I wish you were here. So this is the lo mein beef noodles with veggies. Okay, so give it a stir for another minute. Perfect. And at this point, you will increase the heat a little bit to the maximum if we're adding the noodles for just a quick minute so we're gonna spread the noodles here look at that gorgeous noodle okay 
So when you place the lo mein, you have to spread the lo mein, okay? And you're gonna cover everything without mixing it for now. With you covering that, all the spices are just steaming to the noodles, which makes it delicious. And upon serving, this is time we'll mix it. So I turn it to nine. That's the ha we're gonna put it to nine for about a minute. Okay, a minute or two. Okay, you can smell everything in the noodles depending on the quantity of your noodles. So with this one, for the sake of our video, I'll make it two minutes and we will mix it shortly and serve, okay? And you can serve it with a good delicious tea, uh, hot tea or cold, whatever you wish. Okay, so look at our lo mein. So she was only cooked for two minutes. Now I'm gonna put my homemade chicken stock, okay? I'm gonna spread it all over. One cup. This is one cup. Perfect, so it's so delicious. So, see the lomen looks so fresh. It wouldn't be brittle. And you have to use a fork to mix it. You gotta be careful because she's already fresh. And we wash her with boiling water for just a minute. Look at the lo mein. The one package of lo mein, which is almost only $3 in Asian market here within our place, will serve like good for six people, guys. This is an amazing meal. You see that? Carefully stir. And she's definitely gorgeous. So after cooking all the spices for about three minutes, you add the lo mein, put the stock. So it's a total of a six minute cooking. It's quick cooking. It's healthy and fresh. Oh, I wish you were here guys, so you can smell this, but try this in your homes. Look at that. Okay, it's ready to serve. You're gonna shut off the fire there. We're not gonna cover her anymore because we only covered her for two minutes or else she will be brittle. That's the secret of Chinese noodles. This this is egg noodles. She's, she's very sensitive. Then lo mein, ramen. Ramen, you have to cook a lot of minutes, but this one, this lo mein egg noodles is a quick meal for everybody. Oh, it's so smelling good, okay? So you just have to use the fork. If you have a bigger fork, it's fine. I'm just careful, this is a large fork already. I need to make sure that I can touch and feel it properly. Okay? And we will serve this to you shortly. Okay, this is our lo mein noodles. See how gorgeous that is and ready for serving. I think it will fit like five to six people, good for five to six people. So this is made from olive oil beef and vegetables and so fresh make sure you follow the measurements guys and the way it is cooked so that the lo mein will be perfectly tasty okay guys thank you for coming hi thank you guys now we made another dish from super Bauche kitchen oh, and click like and subscribe guys for more videos watch this for tonight and sorry my outfit because I just come from walking you need to click like and subscribe and leave some comments below and do it for yourself too and share it to me whatever you have done at home have a nice